A suspected gunman has been shot dead by German police near the Israeli consulate and a Nazi history museum in Munich, according to Bavaria State's interior minister Joachim Herman. Witnesses reported hearing a flurry of gunshots. A police spokesperson confirmed the reports, adding that there was no indication any other suspects were involved. The suspect was killed in the exchange, which involved five police officers, according to a spokesperson. Local media outlets were quick to point out that the incident took place on the 52nd anniversary of the assassination attacks at the Munich Olympics of 1972 in which Palestinian terrorists killed two Israeli athletes and took nine others hostage, who were subsequently killed in a botched rescue attempt. The terrorists had wanted to obtain the release of 200 prisoners in Israel, as well as the Red Army faction terrorists Andreas Bader and Ulrika Mainhoff. No immediate connection between the incident and the anniversary was made by police. Police said there was no evidence of any more suspects connected to the incident. They increased their presence in the city, Germany's third biggest, but said they did not indicate incidents at any other locations or of any other suspects. Israel's foreign ministry said the consulate in Munich was closed when the shooting occurred and that no consulate staff had been affected by the incident. The Israeli General Consulate and the nearby Nazi Documentation Center are under constant police watch, but have been under increased surveillance since the escalation of the conflict in the Middle East.